Hello again, everybody. Um, so we're going to do a really super short video on splanchic circulation, um, which is uh, basically what we're going to cover is the celiac trunk, its three branches, and the two mesentery arteries. Um, so let's start off with the celiac trunk. I had to remove the liver, and I actually removed a ton of arteries as well. This app is very good at arteries. Um, so the gallbladder is still here, so you can kind of approximate you know, where the liver would be the pancreas would be in this area. You can still see the spleen and the stomach. So right behind the liver, kind of in the, the center of this lesser curvature of the stomach, boom, right here is the celiac trunk. It's actually right underneath the suspensor, uh, suspensory muscle of the duodenum, which kind of suspends the duodenum like its name implies. So right there is this trunk. It's very distinct looking. It has three branches. And the trunk itself is really short. On a quiz, honestly, I would I would tag it more like like just this here. They include the branches as well, but I would say what is this structure? And you would say celiac trunk. Yes, three branches. It's easy to remember them based on the direction they're heading. So this one here, it's pretty clearly heading towards the liver. Here's the gallbladder. We know the liver is going to be right in that area. So that is the common hepatic artery. That is the artery that supplies the liver with a lot of his blood. Here, pointing towards the spleen. Now, this one's tougher because you could say stomach as well, but you can see where the spleen is. I'll try to include the spleen in the photo on a quiz. That is the splenic artery, supplying the spleen with blood. And then the smallest of the three, heading towards the stomach, is the left gastric artery. And you can see all of its branches that would supply the stomach with blood, with arterial blood. So uh, that is the celiac trunk and its three branches. Then we have two uh, mesentery, two arteries that supply the mesenteries. This first one is quite big. It's the superior mesenteric artery. That is quite the artery. Um, then down lower, I don't think we need to remove the stomach. Is it? It's not this one. No. Here we go. I remember. It's, I always remember it's very close to the split of the iliac arteries. So. Um, there it is, that is the inferior mesenteric artery. So superior mesenteric, inferior mesenteric. Now, if you were taking a class where you needed to know all of, all of these branches, and I actually removed quite a few, um, it can be pretty tough, but we're just covering these, these six arteries. So those are the only six you're going to see tagged. So remember, if you see something down low like this, that's inferior mesenteric. This big, huge one is superior mesenteric, and then the celiac trunk is very unique looking, and you know it's three branches, common hepatic, splenic, and left gastric. And that is it, you guys. Thank you.